Welcome back to KG Gaming, guys. Today, we are in... We're in Silver Ridge Peaks, and we're going to be hunting down one of the most dangerous animals in the game, if you're not careful. We are hunting down the bison. These things will rip you a new one if you shoot one and don't kill it. Now to hunt these bison, I'm picking up two of honestly the worst guns in the game. We have the 4570 Coachmate, which I reviewed in this video right here. Literally terrible. And then I have the second worst gun in the game. It's the 65. Six more Creed more, whatever you want to call it. I don't know. I'm thinking they might actually be good if you use them at the right time. For a 65, we're looking for a 200 yard plus shot. For the 4570, I think we're be looking for maybe a charging one, you know, because if we can catch one charging, that's where the 4570 is really going to come in clutch because it does reload kind of quick and it is a pretty heavy duty bullet. We just got to find a herd of bison and see what we can do with it. Oh, there goes something. And I do want to say this. Yes, we are bison hunting, but I will shoot whatever we see, okay? We're also fundraising, okay? I'm trying to make a lot of money so that I can go out and review a gun that you guys want to see. Maybe you want to see the 3030. I don't know. Boom, right there, a thousand dollars just for a little pronghorn. We are after bison, but I will take opportunities like that all day long. Usually you can see a bison up here sometimes. We'll glass this hillside real quick. See if we see any. Oh, yeah. Oh, never mind. Those rocks. Check out this hillside. I ain't seeing nothing. That's okay. We're gonna move spots. I think I, I think we can find them. Alright, there's a turkey. Gonna be honest, guys, we're gonna take that shot, okay? Turkeys are worth actually a lot of money and they're super easy to kill. All you gotta do is hit them. Free turkey, free money. Oh, what is that? We got pronghorn up there. We'll take them, dude. Easy turkey, $900 cash. That's good. I'll take it. All day. There's the pronghorns. There, there's a four. That ain't a bad one on either. Hey, man, I think that if I can get up here and hit those six, five, if I can take that four. I need him to stop right there and I can take it. Stop, 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 stop. Got him. He's going down. We're supposed to be killing bison. And we're out here shooting pronghorn and turkey. I don't know what we're doing, but hey, we're trying. We just ain't seen a bison yet. We out here hunting. We'll take whatever we can get. Luckily, it ain't like hunting simulator where uh, you gotta buy tags and stuff. That's ridiculous. I don't, I don't know about that game. We got a bison up there. Let's just take it easy. Let's stop running. Let's just walk. The thing about bison is that they are very huge. Very massive targets and easy to hit. But sometimes they can get aggressive. And if they get aggressive, they will charge you. And if they charge you and you don't move, they will run you over. Oh, there he is. There he is. I'm going to go ahead and take him. He sees me. Oh, that may not have been the best shot. I'm going to go ahead and collect him. Boom. I don't know if that bison's charging me. I don't think he is. He's not charging me. I'll shoot him again. Oh, that was a good shot. Oh, there's something. What is that? Okay, I don't know what that is, but I gotta shoot it. Looked like a bear chasing after it. It was a bear. Oh, I can take him. I can take him. I can take him. I can take him. No! Well, that's unfortunate. Anyway, since we only have two shots left on the 6.5, I'm gonna go ahead and switch to the 45.70 in case we get up here and he tries to charge. Even though the 45.70 is pretty terrible and doesn't have any range at all, if I do get up close with one... I think it should be able to stop it. It's right over here somewhere. I shot it with that 6.5 twice, and it's still on 50 to 75 health. And according to the stats, the 6.5 is capable of killing a bison. I don't reckon, brother. Maybe if you shoot it six times. Okay, yeah, it actually did kill it. Well, a good, good job, I guess. The first shot was a pretty good one. It went into liver. Second shot was just flesh. It did kill it, but we did have to track it pretty far. Like, it didn't go down fast. Now we just need to go somewhere to find more bison. This is a pretty good spot for bison. While we're switching low locations. Product of the day is a stinking fishing fanny pack, okay? It's spring. Fishing is coming up. And hey, if you want to buy a good fanny pack, it's got pockets for pliers, small tackle boxes, worms right here, hooks right up here. It's a pretty good setup. I ain't gonna lie. I built it from the ground up trying to make the perfect fishing pack. And I think I did. So if you want it, it's kennelgrade1.com slash shop and use promo code GAMING10, all caps, and that's going to get you guys 10% off the fanny pack or literally whatever you guys want. Now, let's see if we can't find another bison and put him on the ground. Hopefully, we can get him to be aggressive. I like it when they charge. It's pretty fun. I was hoping to use the 6.5 to reach out there and poke one and then let him charge. We're having a hard time finding them. There's some pronghorn way out there. I'll probably just let them walk. We're going to try to get us a bison. I have been attacked by a bear, but the bears don't necessarily charge you. They just kind of, I don't know, man. If you get too close of them, they just go and maul you. It's kind of strange. I've not been mauled many times, but when you do, it's a, it's a life-changing experience. 
It'll rock your world. But ain't no bison here. We're leaving. We're going to the Yukon Valley. There's a lot of bison there. This is my favorite map, by the way. I really like the Yukon. I think it's awesome. Comment below what your favorite map is. Pretty sure most people's favorite map is Silver Ridge Peaks. But just let me know down in the comments. What is your favorite map? And why? I like Yukon Valley because it has open spaces to where you can see things out there. But at the same time, it has multiple different landscapes that you can jump around to. And it's almost like hunting a completely different map. Skills. I have zero skills. Perks. I have zero perks. What kind of perk do I want? The weather? Ability to gauge the wind? I think I'm going to be able to gauge the wind. That seems like a good one. How am I supposed to predict the wind? How does that even work? There we go. There's a bison. He has no idea we're here either. We're just going to sneak up to that pine tree in front of us. Looks like a fur. May not be. I don't know. We're going to put the hurt on. I think in order for them to get aggressive though, they need to kind of know where you are and kind of get a little skittish or something. That way they know where to run if they want to run from you. So, oh, he's alarmed. I'm going to get a little bit close. Oh, he's running. Fine. We'll put a bullet in him. We'll see what he does. He might run towards us. He might run away. He's running away. Jamal, track it. Six, five, terrible shot. I'd say it didn't do much to him at all. Show it to me, Jamal. Show it to me. Oh, there it is. Dang, dude. I think it's dead. You know, that's honestly, that's kind of crazy. The six, five has killed both the bison. I'm trying to get make one be aggressive. I hit it in the liver. Goodness, that's crazy. I only got five hundred dollars from it. I don't know what the that, I don't know what the deal is there. We're trying to get some charging bison. We ain't gonna get no charging bison if the bison don't charge. And they ain't gonna charge if we kill them with a six five. We're going to exchange the six five, and instead we're going to get. You know what? No, we're just going out with the forty five seventy. Whatever. Plan on getting the M one, but I ain't got ammo for the M one. All right, boys, we're just gonna head head to that waypoint, and there's a good chance. Somewhere along the road, we'll find bison. I'll catch you guys when we get there. If we get there. I hit a tree. Here they are. Get your gun. Get your gun. Get your gun. If I can find it. Goodness. All right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. All right, there's one. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's see how many we can get. Let's exterminate. Exterminate, boys. Now I got to reload. Reload your gun. That's the thing about this old junk, is it? Don't, don't stink and holds, th holds three. Calls himself a cowboy and can't reload. All right, that's it. That's all the ammo I got. I'm done. Call that what you want it, but it wasn't charging bison. It was bison running beside me. Now let's go ahead and let's collect the bison. I shot nine shots and every single one bullet went into something. Here's one. We shot it twice. One in the neck and then one also in the neck. Sure, I'll take it. $700. Absolute rip off. This one, lung shot. It actually went down kind of fast. $700. We have another bison. $778. That's not good. You can look up there. You can see some bison up there. That's just too bad, too sad, because I don't have any ammo. And I can tell you right now, Jamal is not going to fight anything. Oh. Hit it in the butt or something. He's tracking oh. blood some more. That was a quick $500. That is terrible. $500 for a bison is terrible. Yes, I, I'm talking to you, Hunter Call the Wild game developers. Give me more money. I need to get rich. Look how close I got to that. Can you imagine if I had ammo, what I could do? Boom. $600 cash. Come on, Jamal. Keep looking. Keep looking. You might find something. All right. Looks like that's all we got. That's all the ammo. I want to give you a little sneak peek of the next video. The place we're going to go is Te Awara National Park. We're going to be hunting a plethora of animals consisting of goats, pigs, turkeys, whatever we see. We are going to be going right up here, and we're going to be using a very special gun, which the animals cannot hear go off. And as for that, that's all I'm gonna say. Click right over here if you wanna see a video where I had some water buffalo charge me, which are literally the biggest animal in the game. Or click right over here if you wanna see the video where I went hunting in the Grand Canyon.